Welcome to Moose Invest in Cambodia and here we are at uh, this uh, technology expo. Actually, we have a special machine at the back. You can see it's like a robot. This uh, robot gives coffee and uh, I'm here with, uh, what's your name? Yep. My name is Panin. Okay. Can you please uh, explain us a bit about this expo? What about some technological uh, products and devices, especially this one at the back yeah. that, that you can share? So this is the GN farm of STID in Cambodia. And this one is we call robot baristas, the robot that can make copies. This robot we cooperate with STS Robotics and we are AI farm. We cooperate with the SES Robotics of Korea. So this is a Korean AI company, corporation, right? Yeah, Korean and Cambodia. Korean and Cambodian, okay. Yes, yes. Cambodia is AI farm. AI, AI farm, AI. okay. Got yes. it. And Korea is STS Robotics. So uh, how is uh, the research of uh, AI in Cambodia? Is it uh, growing? Uh, many students doing this? Yes, now in Cambodia, it starts growing and researching. I saw um, uh, one of my students, uh, I forgot the name of the university, but he developed like uh, something to fly, right? Yes. Can you like uh, explain to the viewers at home a little bit about this? What do you know? Um, at AI Farm Robotic Company, we also have the division, uh, drone division. We build drone and we also test it. Yeah, it can fly like other countries. Wow, wow, wow. Um, so what do you see uh, in the next five to ten years? Where do you think Cambodia will be with AI and technology? Do you think Cambodia will grow uh, by much in the next five to ten years? Yeah, I think in the next five or ten years, Cambodia will grow in AI and robotics as well. Okay, that's good. Are you a student or you're a researcher? I am a researcher in private company, in AI farm. AI farm company? Yes. Okay, what is the website for uh, viewers at home to check? Company, is there a website? Yeah, we have a website. www.aifarm.dev Okay, thank you very much. I will get your name card, okay? Yes. Thank, thank you very much. Yes. Thank you. Robot. This yeah. is a robot, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Could you show us how it works? Yes. Uh, this robot we are controlled by our tablet. Yeah. Yes. So we can control it for walking forward, backward, right, right, and also and many action. Okay. So uh, what is the function of this uh, robot? Yes. Currently, the function is this robot is can walk like the dog. Okay. Can walk and run when. Ubu life arise, yes, and also it can peace. Wow, yes. wow, wow. Is this a uh, Cambodian uh, product? Yes, yes. Wow, really? Cambodian? Yes. Wow. Yeah. Did you make it? Yeah, yeah. We wow. are making it. Uh, because we are have the team to build this. Yeah. We have the mechanic call, engineer, okay. uh, 3 design program, and a developer. So we are combined all of this nature to build this robot. Wow, wow, wow. Interesting. Yes. Wow. It's uh, uh it's really impressive. No, no, no. This, this is this is like a dog. This is like a dog, yeah. A lot of uh technological advancement that is uh being made in Cambodia. This robot we are built from the AI farm robotic factory. Okay. Yeah. So we are have uh, this robot dog we build the purpose for the STEM education to kids to programming or uh, coding to build uh, the robot to working. Uh. How long did you guys take to build this? Uh, maybe uh, nearly one year and a half. One year and a half. Wow, one year and a half they spent just to make this. Wow. Any foreign investors that are investing in Cambodia for uh, AI? Yeah, yeah. There are there are investors, right? Yes, because uh, the AI farm will take our okay. company. So this company is from where? Which country? Uh, they from include? Cambodia. Cambodia yeah. and uh, some foreign investors, right? Thank you very much. Thank, thank, you. You. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You can see with the, the AI robot here, Cambodian made. Very impressive at this uh, technological expo. Many students here too. Showing case uh, Cambodia's development in AI and uh, technology. So I'm here with my old student Kim Su, and yeah, uh, he used to be my old student. He has something to show 
everyone here. Could you share a little bit about uh, your project? Uh, so let me introduce myself. My name is Ho Kim Se, or people used to call me Kim Su as well. So right now I'm currently studying in Kiryong Institute of Technology, the school that is on the mountain of uh, Kiryong National Park. Top of the mountain. Yeah. yeah. Okay. On top of the mountain, the national park. Uh, of Cambodia. So uh, I would like to show uh, you today uh, our project that we've yeah, been sure. doing. So the first one is face recognition and attendance checking. Uh, our school use automated system or we can call consider it as AI as well. So when the student go into the class, they don't have uh, the lecturer or the teacher doesn't have to take attendance. They can just go and sit down and our system will capture their face and no who's attend the class and who are absent. For the second one, since we are living on top of the mountain and in the dorm, there are many students and we need to have a schedule for laundry. So this is what we came up with, the system that allow students to have their own schedule once uh uh, which day if their schedule is, they will receive QR code for the laundry system. When they receive the QR code, they can scan it and then uh, they can choose which machine uh, to use. Number one, number two, number three, etc. And uh, when they enter the which machine which uh, they want to use, they will be able to use the machine. And this is dashboard in order for you, uh, the student to know which machine is available to use and which is uh, which are busy. You can contact us through Telegram, Kiridom uh, Institute of Technology, or follow us on Facebook, Kiridom Institute of Technology. So basically, this is like a, a scan system. You scan, and then you can enter everything yeah, yeah. in the system, right? Yes, yes. AI generated, right? Yes. Yeah, okay. I see. And also for the laundry. Yes, sir. Okay, one more question is, uh, what's your uh, estimation? How many attendees are uh, for this today's event? Oh, my estimation. Yeah. Probably let's say around at least uh, a thousand. A thousand, thousand people. people. Okay. Yeah, students and... Uh, yeah, yesterday and uh, Sunday, there are not much students. And this is the last day. There are tons of people that come here today in this event. Okay, and uh, one more question. Uh, uh, what do you think about my uh, performance as a teacher uh, when I was uh, uh, a teacher? Was I actually a... I did learn a lot from you. Okay. I learned about grammars and how to uh, pronounce certain words very well. Yeah, 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 that yeah. helped me improve a lot in my later year in studying English. Okay. Thanks to you that okay, I be able to yeah. speak English this good. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, okay. you are you are actually the one like teach me a lot how to. Uh, Speak English properly. Okay, but you remember my punishments, right? Yeah, I uh, I will not speak my. Again. <laughs> okay. The okay. thing I remember uh, from more is I will not speak English. Okay, so again, uh, thanks for uh, showing us around. In Cambodia, there is an institute for AI, right? Yes, yes, sir. Okay, okay, got it. So you think AI will uh, become big, huge in the next five years, ten years in Cambodia? Yeah, definitely. Okay. All right. Thank you.